this is about to be something I've never done before, and it's going to challenge me in a way that I may not, I may or may not be ready for. What's going on guys, Javon Langford here. I'm at Astana down in Uluwatu, Bali, Indonesia right now. Dave has been so gracious to allow us to come out here and get a full body experience. When you're in your head 85% of the time, coaching, training, reading, and developing people, it's important that we go back into our bodies. What's happening here? What are we doing today? Uh, we're about to dive into a cryotherapy, minus 110 Celsius. Celsius, none of this Fahrenheit, it's not man. degrees, I don't, it's like zero, oh, minus I don't know, thousand man. degrees. I don't know, minus 110, so <laughs> your boy's gonna come out alive. Ready? Ready to rock, brother. He then goes on to say, the higher power is asking for our intention, and the inner child is asking for our attention. And if you can set an intention, and then pay attention to what your spirit, what the inner child, what the voice, is saying to you and trust that process, life that you live and lead becomes effortless. Not easy, becomes effortless because you are present. One thing you said before, I wasn't sure if you were just trying to get like the pipes in the in the oh, shot or whatnot. No, I, 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 no. <laughs> but um, one thing you said before about like trying to figure out if you're man enough, and I feel like so many times in my life, and then guys that are close to me as well, where we we've spoke on this, is we externalize trying to prove to ourselves that mm -hmm. we're men. Yeah. If I sleep with her, if I get this job, if I drive that car, yeah. and then we get there and we're dealing with the exact same issues. I grew up not really having experience like this. We didn't go on family vacations. We didn't have like these great adventures and excursions. So for me, this is like a, what's going through my head right now is like, this is about to be something I've never done before. And it's gonna challenge me in a way that I may, not, I may or may not be ready for. So stay tuned. Cool temperature. Okay. At minimum. That's cold. That's cold. You know, brown people, we like warm weather, right? <laughs> yeah. So this is gonna, this is a little bit of an experience for me, but I'm, I'm, I'm trusting you. The coldest place in Perth, minus 96 degrees. Okay. If you have a look at the screen here, currently we are measuring at minus 100 and Also, this is the coldest place in the world. Okay. All right. 30 seconds on the first and the second chamber, and maximum three minutes on the third chamber. Okay. So, okay. Very Woo! Yeah. Ah. Yeah. 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 It was like a baptism, an ice, ice tism. I'm thankful for being and also look forward to coming back and experiencing the entirety of this place. So we love you guys. We thank you so much, Mikkel, Dave, the whole crew. Yogi Lab, we thank you guys, the team. You guys are doing a phenomenal job. Thank you for what you're creating the world. We need more places like this for healing to take place and leaders like myself. Love you guys, thank you so much. Marriage and librarians, and my mom being a pervy bookworm, and all this funny shit. 